Hello, 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 hello. Hello, everyone. So you might be able to tell, but I decided to sit on the floor today. So, yep, I hope this isn't too weird of an angle with my computer up here and me down here. So hello, 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 hello. <laughs> like always, my live streams are brought to you by my wonderful patrons on Patreon, and they're pretty awesome, so you should go check them out. The ones that are at the level or above to get shoutouts are Eric, Cheryl, and Catherine. They're all awesome, so go check them out. Or go check out Patreon. I'm, yeah, anyway. <laughs> it's been a day. Anyway, so. Today we are going to unbox my Catholic t-shirt club box. I haven't even opened it yet. I'm excited to get into it. But first of all, so in my cup today with you all, I have Izzy. Um, I got this sparkling peach Izzy at Costco. And actually, this is the story. When I figured out that I got these at Costco, I couldn't figure out why my bill was $4 more than I thought it was supposed to be. And then I discovered that Oregon has this stupid thing where you pay extra when you get a bottle. Hello, I see two people there. Hello, Nicole and Marie. Yeah, so apparently with Oregon, you pay 10 cents for each can when you buy it. And then you have to like return them somewhere special to get like your money back. And it's kind of weird. But yeah, I discovered that when I got two cases of these at Costco and was like, why did I pay $4.20 more than I thought I was going to? because they're cans. So now I know. But yeah, this is pretty good. The peach one I haven't had before until I got this variety pack. So I like it. I just poured it into a cup to make it easier for drinking because it's a bit warm today. I'm trying to figure out how to, okay. Hello everyone. Okay, let's see how this works. Are you ready? I'm ready. So I have sticky notes covering up my info. Um, the post office here writes on your post office box and all of your information when they check it in so that it's easier for them to find when you go to pick it up or something weird like that. But I've got my scissors. I'm excited. Okay. Ooh. I'm pretty sure the theme this time, oh, hello, Paola. I'm pretty sure the theme is Our Lady and Doer of Knots um, because I remember reading that email, but I didn't click on the email that had the picture of the shirt because I wanted to be surprised. Ooh, they're having a novena challenge this month. How exciting. Oh, hello, Glenda. So the first thing you see is this beautiful, beautiful t-shirt. There is no knot that cannot probably be undone is what my guess is, but let's see what it says. There is no knot that cannot be undone. Our Lady Endure of Knots, Mary Endure of Knots, pray for us. This is really beautiful. That's cool. So it's got like the knots on it. That's really awesome. So this is the t-shirt this month. I like it a lot. Can you tell? <laughs> there is no knot that cannot be undone. I like that one. Okay, and then we get the rosary, the Undoer of Knots rosary. Uh, I have a bunch of these type of rosaries. It's the same as the Holy Spirit one they've sent before, and I also have the St. Clair ones like it that I gave all of my students last year in religious ed. So this one is Our Lady Undoer of Knots, or Mary Untire of Knots, Undoer of Knots. I've heard it both ways. Oh, this is so cute. I almost bought one of these today when I was at, um, the grotto actually, so that's kind of funny. But it's like a little rosary pouch with Our Lady Undoer of Knots on it. And they're, they're really like roomy rosary pouches too. Like there's a lot of room in there and it's got the little hook so I can hook it right on my um, purse. So I'm excited about this because I almost bought one and then I was like, I saw this one there and I went, my box is Undoer of Knots, I think. So I should wait and see if I get it. I got it, so that's really awesome. <laughs> And then there's this little baggie that has a prayer card and a medal in. Oops. So the prayer card, it's beautiful. And on the back, it's the prayer to Mary Untire of Knots. This is a long prayer, like it's really little writing on here. Usually prayer cards have a little bit larger writing, but this one is so small. And then there's the little medal. So that's really cool. 
Okay, let's see what else we get. And then we get the Mary and Doer of Notes, the, um, the insert that talks about her, and then the part that talks about St. Irenaeus of Lyon's quote, Mary and Doer of Notes. Thus it was the knot of Eve's disobedience was loosened by the obedience of Mary, Irenaeus of Lyon. So this is a, just a really nice box. It's just simple because you didn't eat a lot of stuff, but it's all very themed. It has the same image. There's one image for Our Lady and Doer of Knots, and I think it's in South America somewhere. Um, where does it say in here? I don't know for sure. I have to find out for sure. I don't remember where exactly where the original is, but there's one image of this. This is the image, and it's a painting somewhere, and it's from like the 18th century or something, but it's very cool. So this that's what this month's box was. So I'm going to move my camera. Let's see if I can do this without making everybody dizzy. So if you get dizzy, I'm sorry. There is no knot that cannot be undone. Mary and doer of knots pray for us. So that was the box this month. So I figured I'd answer some questions. If you guys have any questions you'd like me to take since I'm, <gasps> I just spilled all over my carpet actually. So that's fun. I tipped over my Izzy which was not cool, but I have a very um, thick carpet here, so it's kind of soaking in and I can get it up later. Oh well. Anyway, <laughs> that's what we got in the box this month. I'm excited about it and it's just, it's been a crazy day, but that's okay. Grad school's going well. My job's going well. It's just, everything's kind of crazy, but hey, we knew that. So yeah, I just wanted to pop on and open up my box because I saved it for all of you. I really wanted to open it earlier in the week, so. I'm glad I waited to share with all of you. Now I should probably go clean up my Izzy before it really soaks into my rug. Yeah. Oh no is exactly right, Nicole. <laughs> um, I'm gonna cut this live stream short so I can go clean it up because it's starting to seep towards me and I don't really wanna sit in a, a pool of Izzy. So <laughs> I'm gonna clean that up and thank you all for watching. I'm sorry this got cut shorter than expected. <laughs> because of the Izzy spill of 2018. So <laughs> I'll see you all next um, Wednesday. I have a video planned to go out on Wednesday. This past week I missed one because my schedule was a bit crazy, but there will be one this week. And I'm also working on some ideas to restructure the channel a little bit. So if you'd like to know more about those ideas, I have them posted on Patreon for my patrons so that they can give me feedback. And I'll see you all next time. Please make sure you like and subscribe. God bless.